saw Alan, the night of the accident, during the mass hallucination. Except, I'm not sure it was a hallucination. We had a tradition. When we were both working late, he'd swing by my lab for a coffee break at some ungodly hour. That night, he visited, we talked, the coffee burned my tongue, nothing out of the ordinary. Seconds later, the gamma ray surge swept through the facility and the roof caved in. I looked for him in the aftermath. I couldn't find him anywhere because he hadn't been in my lab. Mm. He was ground zero at the accident site, miles away in the deep zone. But I saw him, touched him, smelled his cologne. He was there, impossibly there. More than a hallucination. You never reported that? Admit to Arda that I communed with my husband's ghost. When they were already looking for ways to push me out, not a chance. I gave them my technology and my home, but I'd be goddamned before I let anything destroy my professional credibility. And this remnant is my last chance to know if what I saw was true, if it came from the well, or if it was all in my head. The things we spoke of, things I couldn't have made up. <sighs> Never mind. I know how it sounds. Like you've seen a ghost. A remnant ghost. That's something we have to scan to get some of the upgrades. Oh, Oppie. It's, stuff is just so weird here. I decided to go for a supply run. Not really a supply run, because uh, the goal today is really just to get to the deep zone and come back. So I was thinking I would, just, I would just get there and come back. I'm in the very first leg of my trip right now, and I have a Good news. hole in my I wheel. Can replicate Alan's suppression method. We'll stand some chance of halting the gamma ray burst from the well. 30 years later, my late husband still manages to impress. They're figuring out how to keep you alive once the reaction gets going, however, that's harder. We don't have, have a plan. Idea. Francis, I need your ear. Go on. We know that as soon as the car gets to the well, the trigger will be instant. Once this remnant expends its energy, gamma radiation will erupt from the well, and the driver will be at ground zero taking the worst of it. But can we activate the gateway as soon as they make contact? It's tricky too early and we may interrupt whatever reaction process the remnant carries out too late and it's bad news for the driver there's too many unknowns only the driver will know the right time to use it how can you be sure they'll live long enough to make that call the we don't device has been transmitting data every single second since it was installed every drop of fuel every spark plug that car's lit i have on record you've been running an experiment this entire time with the driver as the guinea pig the mere act of being alive is the biggest experiment of all, dear. Is that another one of Alan's sayings? That one's all mine. Driver, we've seen that car protect you this entire time. It's triggered a gateway in your time of need. It's ferried you back to the garage through every circumstance and obstacle and bump in the road. So we can trust that it'll protect you long enough to get you away from whatever and wherever you end up. Still sounds like a heavy dose of blind faith to me. Could be. It is. There's one last part to this, and it's waiting for you back at the auto shop. Take your time. Enjoy the view. Okay. I'm just trying to make it to the deep zone today and come back. I brought very, very few supplies. I've collected very few supplies on purpose, and I've been driving with a flat the entire time because I didn't bring a spare tire. And so we'll see how we fare. Limb magnet. I think I picked up something new here. Hey, we're at the, the crossing zone again. Uh, my car is doing very not good. Let's put it that way. Oh, actually, I just remembered. I do have some spare panels here, don't I? I do. Okay, hold up. I, I just remembered this as I was doing this. <gasps> I've got a bumper as well. Maybe we can fix this. I, I didn't think we were going to do too much today, so I purposefully didn't bring enough supplies. And that's been turning out to be a bit of a disaster so far. Because I don't have supplies to craft any backup equipment with. I'm actually just going to replace this because I don't think I'll be using the limb post emitter anyway. Especially with the limb shield. Alright, hold up. Armored door. Okay, we're actually getting somewhere. Hold up. 
I did something that I think is really smart though, and I want praise for it, so uh, I'll show you what I did. You know how I was having the problem with the back left tire being blown out? So the whole time I was driving lopsided. Oh, meteorite squall. Oh, I think there's some. Oh! How about we talk about this later? We'll talk about this in a sec. Uh, I need to get out of the range of the squall first. Okay, I think we're good for now. Wow, that was scary. And we just need to leave here. We're at the zone right now, but I, I committed to going to another place. So I, I guess I'll get some energy. If, I don't want... <sighs> I really want to go home today, though, because I just wanted to clear the road. So maybe I'll even give up on supplies here. Anyway. So I had the problem where the car was constantly leaning towards the left side because I have one blown out tire on the left. And then I ended up getting another blown out tire on the front left wheel. And the whole thing was just not working out. So what I did was I shifted the front left blown out tire to the right side. So now that it's like that, it's sort of weirdly balanced out and I can drive normally again. <laughs> hey, that's pretty smart, right? I feel like that might be a tactic that's possible in real life too. Although having two Messed up tires in real life would probably be pretty bad. Yeah, okay, so I, I don't think... I think we need to just... Exit. This place looks really similar to where we just were, though. I really don't have any supplies. I don't even have enough supplies to make a hand vac, to make a spare tire, nothing. I don't know how much supplies we're gonna be able to gather. We did get a limb magnet just now, like a little bit of something. And I think these... Yeah, these are cables that we connected. Oh, there's some nice graffiti here. But clearly, there's been very little cars, that kind of thing, just because a place not many people have been here, I guess. At least they're nice enough to give us these rest spots. I don't even know... Oh my god. I don't know if the limb shield works for other stuff. I think it works for deterring radiation and whatnot. Okay, maybe let's not mess with this guy then. <laughs> this guy seems like he's gonna be annoying. The rocks are breathing, he says. I'm using the limb shield actively right now, by the way. I should probably not do that. Yikes, though. Okay, that was... I think we should go. We should go. We don't have that kind of... We barely have supplies today. I have battery jumpers, so I'm not worried about the battery front. But literally everything else, yikes. We need to just grab this and turn around and go home. Really? <laughs> and I don't wanna... I don't wanna see those pickpockets up close again. They were kind of like the bubblegum dudes. But bigger and more pickpockety. Is this corrupt energy? Okay. We just need to make it to the next zone and then open the gateway and come back. I don't know if we can though, my car... I... Whoa! I... I accidentally picked up the whole thing, instead of looking into it. Ugh. I put my good car doors inside the regenerator, so I'm using crappier doors. It's not that much crappier, I'm using the insulated stuff that we had before, but it's not my main stuff anymore. And uh, my whole plan today just wasn't very smart. I think we should go. Forget about the energy. There will be more of where it came from. Or something, right? Yeah, I think I'll just go back the way I came from and hope for the best once we get to the exit. <sighs> Meteorite squall, though. That was... 
I don't know if they made it so that it never hits your car, or did I just get lucky earlier? Okay, yeah, we definitely need to be going. The channel might switch. Yeah, something is still... Lots of quirks going on here. With my car. That's fine. It's our old beloved car. That's just the way it functions. We gotta get back on the main road and just drive to the exit. Storm is slowly coming. My wheels are not in working condition. I did collect a few marsh eggs and the neon, uh, the swamp coral stuff a little bit. But then my hand vac broke. So that ended pretty quickly. Can I go here? Yeah, I think the only thing I'm confident about is pretty much the battery. And the gas. I think we should be fine for gas, but everything else... Oh my gosh, my wheels. Is that a transmuter? It's just randomly sitting here? Oh wait, LIM magnetizer. Magnetizer. Oh, sometimes I just want to know what it does, okay? <laughs> Machine parts and magnets. Mag- Wait, recommended tool. What did it say? I feel like I don't have time to look at this. It said something about scrap metal, right? But I... I think I have some in the car, maybe? By the way, it's very irradiated. I don't think I should be. But it's the first time I've seen it. We have one at home, actually. I think it's the, the thing that's been in the garage that's been doing nothing. Oh! Oh, that's how we get magnet- Okay, in that case, every single piece of scrap metal, I'm gonna put it here because we have so much back home, I don't need it. I'm gonna bring all the magnets I have. These are all empty, I don't even have stuff in it. But we can get a few magnets if we put it here. Are magnets radioactive? Is that why we're getting her from this? <laughs> Yeah, 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 thanks. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. I don't even know how many scrap metals it takes for one magnet. Doesn't matter. Probably value the magnet more. 14, we got 14. Okay, that's good, that's good. Can we make it out of here alive, though? I know it looks like we're doing okay, but I feel much worse about our current situation than any other time because I I really just came here thinking it was going to be a quick trip. I didn't bring anything, and I feel like it's coming back to bite me in the butt. Is that also a magnetizer? Is it the same thing? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, so you're supposed to just come here and find a lot of these magnet <laughs> A lot of these magnetizers to build magnets because supposedly we need a lot of magnets for some future stuff. I set... Uh, I wish I didn't set my goal today for the next zone over. Because now we gotta go to the next zone and then exit out of the gateway to get out of here. Which hopefully we can do. Uh... Explosives? Yo, there's a storm. I, I got... I really gotta go. Wait. How do you even pick up the crate? How did I pick up the crate last time? It's not even possible to, right? How did I... Oh my god, okay. That's a pickpocket. And I think it's paired with a bubblegum buddy. Okay, go, go, go. We'll start exploring next zone over, okay? We really want to explore. We gotta go. He's gonna go. Don't touch me! Don't touch me!
Oh. What did it take? What did you take? What did you take? My side storage, you're kidding me! My whole side storage. What about the stuff inside? Okay. Oh my god, you can do that? Now we really gotta go. There's a purple thing, I don't care. We just gotta drive straight and get out of here. Uh, my wheels. But this, this can be a test to see how long these kind of wheels can last for. Because I really have been driving the entire day today with broken wheels. Battery's looking pretty okay though. I'll show you once we get back home, but one thing I did do was, you know how I made the, the back seat gas tank? I realized I could also get the next upgrade, which was a bigger backseat gas tank. So yeah, that's the one I have installed right now. Never ended up using the one that I... that you saw me craft and put inside the car. Maybe I'll recycle that when we go back home or something. Oh, that's a... Is that a meteorite squall again? Could you just stop? I know there's stuff around. I think I'm- my gas is okay too. We should have full fuel tanks. You can see the green. The green is our salvation. Overall, this zone is less dangerous than I thought it would be though. Oh, it's coming in really fast. I wanted to stop to try to get... Maybe there's some fragments inside the cars, but I'm not even gonna stop for that. That It's coming in really fast. If it's a meteorite squall, we're done. Because it might hit my car and just severely injure it. I'm not gonna chance that. It's literally right behind me. Okay, we've somehow made it through. Ish. <sighs> Alright, I don't know why I picked a ghost in such a deep place. But that's what I did. This one, exhausting explosions. In this part of the zone, damage suffered from explosions will also take its toll on both fuel and battery reserves. Fantastic. Great. Wait. Oh my god, we were only here! We haven't even been here yet! Jeez! Meteorite medley. This one's high in stability, god. Oh, this is a shorter road today. Okay, but the, the conditions are extremely dangerous. I think I'm actually gonna leave here. I set the course for one zone beyond this, but it's just too dangerous and I don't feel good right now with the amount of supplies I have. I'm probably going to grab the stable energy the energy, and then maybe open this one if I can. It's dark. It's scary. Place is all messed up. It's a bit unfortunate though because if I choose to leave here then I'm not going to be able to extend the reach of my map. But I really do want to go home now. I, I don't feel good. I don't feel good. If I was more prepared. That's the thing about preparedness, though. Do I really have to salvage resources like crazy in the beginning legs of each trip? Because that it really does get a little bit tiring. It's a bit of a grind. Oh, wow, what the hell was that? Or should I be bringing resources from home? Resource! Oli oh, Olympian vein! Oh no! Magnetic hammer! That's how you get it. Okay, well now I know. Now I know, but obviously I can't make it here because my workbench is too crappy and I can't even... I don't even have the magnetic hammer thing. I can make a little bit more stuff than before though. That's a little bit more reassuring. I can't make a hand vac because the workbench is too crappy on my car. 
We can upgrade it, but not right now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can't even... Oh, we're on a bridge. We have to wrap back down. Oh, I see. Honestly, I might just... I can get these ones and then... Yeah, I think it, that'll be for the best. I'll grab all the energy and then go to the other... The gateway should be very linear road. Hopefully. How do we wrap back down? Here? Can I just go down? Will I die? Oh. Uh. Oh, okay. We are somehow alive. You're already coming in. Okay. Alright. I'm just gonna grab what I can then. I, I really gotta go. Before things get worse. Woo! Is this far enough? I'm driving very slow now because my car, I think the wheels are really just, they're completely giving out. You're not gonna hit me, right? Don't hit. Radiation is insane. How are the bubblegum buddies even existing here? Are they radiation resistant? Okay, they are dragging my car. I activate my trap card. Also known as the limb shield. Okay. There's some kind of a squall coming. I'm just gonna turn back right- Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, this is a bit of a problem. We really, really have to go. I know this is a bad idea. I didn't even mark it on my map. Can I see it? Oh, it's so far. It's actually further than I expected. Come on. What? What? Someone is- Oh! You can have it, you can have it. You can have your scrap or whatever it is. I don't care. I have the anti-theft gloves or whatever, don't I? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, we really. <gasps> the storm is coming in at the same time. This is gonna be bad. Oh, I really don't. I really don't have to. Oh! But I, I can't get it though because I can't go beyond the gate. Because you know it's just a light there, right? I can't go beyond it. That's a bit of a shame. Interesting spot for it to have dropped that, though. <laughs> I haven't actually c confirmed that this road connects, but I really, really hope it does. Not on the road, not on the road. Oh god, Devil's Grinder. No, 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 no. Don't know if the limb shield helps. Probably only helps with electricity. Can I go around? Oh, I might be able to. Okay. Alright. 
I'm gonna park right here. Oh, two drop! You're joking! What? It's happening! I need to drop this crap because I know it's gonna be a pain. Just put it down. Put it down. Oh my goodness. Is this your way of telling me, hey, this is a reward for you going through so much or ordeal and turmoil today? Yeah, but is it gonna be anything good though? That's the second thing too. It's crap. Steel door, blowtorch. Oh, come on. These are just... First of all, I don't have room for this, but I'll take your stuff though. I'll take whatever I can. Which is not much. Okay. So I don't know where the other payload was, but I don't think it's going to be anything good. It's going to be the same kind of stuff. And I can't see it anymore. I, 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 <laughs> I'm having trouble seeing where it is. The payloads are dropping left and right though. That's kind of cool. Yeah, look at that. Oh, no, no. It's just the same one as before. That one's a little bit further away. Let's go. That's pretty cool. The car is completely wrecked, but... I can't believe we drove the entire way with the tires like that. Happy Oppy? Fresh new upgrade waiting for you, driver. Straight out of the oven. The anomaly barricade overcharged the arc device. So the, the one bad thing today was that I didn't extend my reach at all. I intend- Oh! Oh, that's where we were supposed to go. Okay, we can actually reach there then. That's where I planned to go this time, but it got too dangerous, so I got scared. But I think it worked out in the end anyway, because it looks like that's that's just where we're supposed to go. Okay, very good, very good. Things are Things are all right today. I'm just curious though, am I right? Can I go there directly? I can. It's gonna be a long trek though. This is uh, yeah, today was a long way. Hmm. Noobatube. News Flash Seattle, February 19, 1969. In a surprisingly public display of displeasure, Pierce County Sheriff Bucko Bostrel sounded off today on what he feels is a lack of support from ARDA and government employees in tracking fugitives who flee to the Olympic Peninsula. Suspects are all too aware that law enforcement is limited in their ability to pursue those who enter this restrict. Yeah, they say don't go in, but they don't actually enforce it. Overcharger Arc Mod. What do you think, Francis? It could work. <laughs> it will work. We don't know anything about the well, but the driver doesn't have to go in completely empty-handed. You're removing the arc device's limiter and overloading its charge capacity. Right. So no matter how much energy the car's getting blasted with, the arc will be able to overpower it to open a gateway. It's the only way to extract the driver from whatever's going to happen at the trigger point. A and then we use Alan's suppression technique to keep the whole thing from completely exploding? This sounds like a lot. <laughs> Does it sound like it'll work? Arc device mods looking good. Now you can head out and overcharge it. We'll give you instructions when you're en route. Okay. Well, I guess this time I can put back on my real supplies. My car is a wreck. It is a wreck. But these were my actual equipment. So I think I think we should be okay. At least we got the nice payload at the end there. Gave us some nice putty and all. If I had time, I guess I could have grabbed the panels, but... Yeah, no, that wasn't happening. Hey! We're, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. How's this looking? Eh, it's okay. It's it's still what it is. Oh, <sighs> alright. I decided to invest a little bit more in myself and not the car this time because, hey! As much as I love my car, I gotta love myself a little bit too, right? So I ended up crafting the thermal vacuum. Ooh, that looks really cool. And the plasma scrapper. 
as well as the magnetic hammer. This is a new upgrade that I just got. I think this means we have the best tools for each of these categories. You can sort of see that, for example, the scrapper has 800 durability, 23 piercing damage, but the plasma scrapper has 38 piercing damage and a much higher durability, twice basically. And it's the same for all of these ones. Which, hopefully this means it'll make our resource gathering much more efficient. And especially the magnetic hammer, I think we... Oh, I'm just sitting here thinking, maybe I should have tried the impact hammer on the Olympium fragment stuff, huh? I didn't even try it. Hmm, I was gonna say, especially because we need the magnetic hammer for the Olympium fragments, but maybe, maybe the normal one would have worked anyway. I'm not sure. But, hey, we have it now. So the next time we see it, we will be prepared this time. Mm-hmm. Fixed up my car. Uh, I think this is as good as it gets, and I also got an XL roof storage. Look at this. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of space. I think this probably means inventory space is not going to be a problem again. But it being on the outside does make me a little bit worried, because what if some pickpocket guy comes and tries to steal it? It's not as durable, right? Some worries here and there, but I feel like we'll be okay. But these side storages, maybe we should be doing something else with it then, because if that's going to be storage, I don't think we need this much. Plus, they're kind of dying. Especially this one here. This one is worn. Which just means that it's just getting old, you can't fix it anymore. So, at the minimum, this one, this one needs to go, I think. No, 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 no. Give me that back. <laughs> I'll... I should probably scrap it because we can't fix it. There's nothing inside, right? Just making sure. It's empty. Okay, thank you. Thank you, side storage. Oh, fabric! I was actually in need of fabric. Maybe this is good for me. Yeah, I... I still have some stuff here. This is my... Oh, but in terms of, like... If we gather resources, do I want to put them on the outside or the inside? I feel like I want to put them here just because it's easier to reach for. So that's my plan for now. And I ended up putting a lot of my tools and whatnot inside the, the trunk of the car instead. I grabbed a few supplies, just in case, if we need to craft anything on the road. I think, yeah, because last trip, the trip just now, one of the problems I had was that I couldn't craft anything because I didn't pick up any supplies. Which is a bit of a problem. I also have a steel door here, just in case. Why not, right? Maybe we should make more use of the Liberator, too. I've barely used it since the beginning. Okay. Wanna look at... You know what? Before we look at more stuff here, upgrades. Should we... I was not aware that we could scrap these things. I don't know why I never thought about it, but... Yeah, I don't need five different cans of blue. Can we just... Maybe scrap some of this and get some good stuff back. Paint stripper? No. No, we're not stripping anything because I I would rather it look like the weirdest mishmash of random stuff than make it look plain. Okay, so let's see here. I think we can just dump it all in the... What's this thing called again? The generator? The constructor. And we can get some supplies back, which would be really, really helpful. Can I just do... No! Oh, damn it, I really hate auto-sorting on this. It doesn't know... There's no lock function. Sometimes I feel like I do a better job. Like, I, I want this here. Just fit, fit these slots in. Make it look nice and all, right? It's something like that. Scrap metal. Chemicals. Do you want to give me fabric? Fabric would be nice. Chemicals? Okay, that wasn't that many. Okay, we'll try the... Thermal vacuum. Whoa. Clearly seems stronger than before already. Alright, interesting. Okay, that's uh... I will look this up later, and I'll put it on the screen. I don't know what this says right now. N probably nothing nice. <laughs> okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. But I think in terms of upgrades, we have some energy, probably the constraint is gonna be supplies. One constraint I had up until now was fabric. I just didn't have enough fabric to do anything. And a lot of the upgrades need fabric. So, we'll see. I think the junction bypass could be nice, but I don't know if I can get all that. 
Mm, yeah. Oh, expanded matter regenerator. Very sad. I, I would love this, but I don't have enough marsh eggs. I'm missing by like 12. Should have gathered a few more when I was outside, but hey, what can you do? So of all these things, I don't have too big of an opinion on what to get, I'd say. Roof rack? Another roof rack? Honestly, I feel like I'm pretty good right now. But maybe we can try some... Even for stuff like battery and fuel. I feel so good with the big tanks and batteries I have that... Do we, do we really need all this stuff? Nitro boost. Auto parker. You know what? Let's invest in some... Some quality of life stuff, right? This means... I don't have to do the parking brake. Yeah? Kind of a useless upgrade, but... This is all about making my life, improving my own quality of life and all that. Do I still have to craft it myself? Really? Is it gonna be an ability or...? Okay... So what, I gotta like, just stick it... Oh, well... Maybe not like that? Where do I install it? Or do I install it? Left ba Oh! Okay, I don't need it. <laughs> yeah, if you if you go to more info, it shows some info on where you're supposed to put it, but if you're telling me I have to remove one battery or a, a fuel tank for this, that is not happening. No. Sorry, no. Crafted this for no reason. Oh well. I'll live. Yeah, I don't have that kind of space. Maybe if we have more battery stuff for other purposes, but... Eh... Okay, let's get this improved antenna range. A antenna. So that we can eventually advance towards the junction bypass. <laughs> At this point, I feel like, I, I don't know, maybe we're getting too close to the end for that to even really be helpful anymore, but... Yeah. Junction bypass is letting us skip maps. That's why I want it. Th that's what I assume it is. I don't actually know. <laughs> that's what it sounds like. This improved antenna business. Are you gonna look the exact same as before? Oh, does it look bigger? I think so. Hard to tell. A little bit of a dark night today. Um, oh. Was that from the thermal vacuum? It went, the stuff went so far? Junction Restabilizer. What does that do? Does it change the condition of the maps that we see? Either way, we don't have enough thermosac crystals, so that's not happening. Yeah, that's what I thought. Marsh eggs. Maybe we'll just leave this alone for now. Liberator. Flare. When do we use a flare gun? I have no idea. Because it shoots out a light somewhere else. So why- when would I want that, really? I don't know. But damn, everything here needs- needs the Olympian Fragment, all the advanced stuff, which makes it kind of hard for me to, um, get anything. The mobile workbench, Olympian Fragments, circuit board. Maybe... Yeah, we- we can get some of the side stuff that lets us regenerate fuel and all that. Fuel synthesizer, wanna try it out? This is gonna be a side thing, right? I think so. This creates gasoline from various environmental substances. But we have to siphon it regularly. Which is work, but... Eh, ah, let's try it out, see what it does. In general, I feel like a lot of these are side grades. They're not really, like, straight-on upgrades. Stuff that you want to try, and if you want to try it, then feel free, but... It's not the... craziest of things. Yeah, maybe we'll just save some of this energy. We got quite a bit. Paddle wheat. Power grip tire. Is that marsh eggs? Oh, this one needs battery. That seems kind of crazy. Because the health is already at the maximum. For the all-terrain wheel, it's already 300. This is the maximum that's possible. This is like, super luxurious wheel that... Nice to have, but you don't need to have it. Gas Reservoir. 
The larger external tank sits directly upon the roof. It's not an elegant solution, but it is a substantial reservoir of additional gasoline. Oh! Maybe this will mean that I can remove the one from the back. The back tank? The back seat? So that I could use the back seat for something else? That could be a thing, but I need a... I think I need a rack for this. I don't think I can get a rack. Yeah, I probably needed stable energy for the rack. Is that how this goes? Where is the rack? Right! I just used... Yeah, okay. Well, let's just forgo this for now then. It's fine. We are fine. Do we wanna spend... Yeah, that... This one is a little bit dead. It's okay for now. It, I don't have important things in it. What did I just make? Fuel synthesizer. Circuit board. I can make that. Okay. This is more for fun though. It's not really like... I'm really depending on it to save my life or anything. Okay, cool. Uh, wait. To begin with, can I put stuff in here? No. It's more that I have to come here periodically and then try to siphon it. Yeah, okay. Makes sense. While I was working on the car, I did hear the radio go off again and again. Oh, I saved this wheel just to show you. This is the wheel I went to the supply trip with earlier and oh my gosh, it's so dead. It's so dead. Bald. Flat. Loose. Thank you for serving me, but you're not fixable anymore. The bald thing, I can't fix it. It's just worn out. Alright, thanks. Yeah, I heard the radio stuff again. I I wasn't driving the car, so I'm wondering if I got the same one again. About how... What was it again? Well, it might not be that one, but um... Battery... I'm gonna try the same one, okay? Battery... Is full. Means... The radio... Changes channel. I really got the exact same quirk again. Seriously. Let me listen to the radio in peace. Damn you. Otherwise, still not too sure about the other three. I think one of them might be like dimming lights or something. Something like that. If the radio switches on, if the trunk... The trunk one would be hard. The car one's gone for some reason. Okay, you know what? Let's get going. Let's get going. Today we gotta go deep into the deep zone, the anomaly barricade. Bit of a long ride. Gusts and gales. Oh, this is gonna be great. And then what else we got here? Anchor obfuscation. Increased magnetic interference means that anchor signatures in this part of the zone are indistinct. It'll be harder to precisely locate them. So I think that's what the anchor radar is for, although I still haven't really used it that well. Turn code! Oh god, my favorite one. Magnified explosions. That's a new one. Light ambient radiation. Torn apart. <gasps> the remarkably strong explosions experienced in this part of the zone may shake parts from your car. Wow. I don't know whether I should hope for us to see some of this stuff because it'll be fun to see? Or should I just hope for peaceful passage? <laughs> well, I'll let you know if anything happens. For now, let's go. Finally getting out of here on a... Um, what, 8 a.m.? Good start. Hopefully things will just get better from here on. Okay, we have a bit of a problem today. I'm on the third map over right now. I haven't even gotten out of my car even one time so far because I've noticed a very, very dire problem. Our battery is draining extremely, extremely quickly. It's going by more than 0.1 per second. And I didn't turn on those wipers just now. Oh god, too many things happening. I think the battery thing might be a quirk, but because the battery, if we're out of battery, I do have jumpers. I have a few jumpers, but if we're out of battery, we just can't even make it back home. I 
Yeah, that's not acceptable, so I'm really trying to expedite this whole thing right now. Just to make sure we can at least get home. Because, yeah, it's already at 50. We started at 100. Not even three maps? And we're already like this? This map that we're in right now, I think, has some fuel evaporation thing going on, too. And I... Why am I not on the road? I don't know. I'm kind of tense right now. Maybe that's why. Oh, we need to get back on the road. It's just so windy. Too much happening here. If we drive safely, it's okay. It's just... Everything is harder to do when it's dark. I... yeah, I, have, I haven't collected anything. I seriously haven't gotten out of the car. Just because I'm so worried about everything right now. Yeah, you can see there might be a lot of anchors here. There might not be. We don't know. It's obfuscated. And I don't think I have time to investigate. How many jumpers do we have? Well, you know, we might need to collect stuff, actually, because... Uh, I need to check... What resources we need to make battery jumpers. That's probably the... for the best. Maybe once we get out of this windy zone, if that's okay. If there are marsh eggs, though, I'll still collect it, because I need... I need 12 more. For whatever upgrade I wanted. <laughs> that's all. Yeah, even just talking that whole time took away about 10 battery, right? That's really bad. And I'm not... The darkness is making me drive in all sorts of weird directions. Chill out, okay? Yes, just go straight. Go straight. Okay, the headlights are probably not helping, but even without the headlights, I tried turning off the ignition. And the battery is still running out. Which is insane. Is there an anchor near here or are you just messing with me? Probably just messing with me. I gotta go. I gotta go. Um, one thing before we go. Oh, we're going. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, okay. I just want to confirm. There's turn code, so my, my car might start moving. I want to confirm what we need to make a battery jumper. Copper wire electronics. So I don't have any of that right now. Oh, fuel. I have fuel though, so that's good. How do I... How do I... Actually, how do I get this? How do I... Like that? No? Maybe figure this out later. I have three battery jumpers. That's all I have today. How much does it give? 30 per use. Okay, so I... I really gotta keep that in mind. I, we gotta go. Look, 52. We... we <gasps> I have never been so stressed. This is just... Stress city, left and right. Oh, there's things to collect here, but I, I don't know if I can... Collect any of it. Some of it along the way. That gigantic thing in the middle. Oh, I'm gonna go this way, maybe. Oh, is my battery okay? Hey, it looks like it's doing better now. Okay. Wow. So the three previous maps all drained my battery? That's kind of insane. The weather is so crappy here right now, though. Goodness. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 I want to scan that, though. I want to scan you. Are you like a charge thing, but... Wait, it's just hot dust? Ticking... Ticking... T oh, God! Oh, that was a that was the explosive crate that got me last time, right? Except it's actually explosive this time. Okay, that's something else. All right, all right. We we need to go. 
Radiant Dredge. They pretend to be the, the crates. My radio is on. <laughs> At least it keeps me company. Or something like that. Okay, I feel better now, now that I see my battery is okay again, but... Yikes! Do you think these are conditions that we can actually collect materials under? Because I don't feel like it. I saw a limb magnetizer there, but... Yeah, I, I just want to go. We still have, like, two more maps after this. Oh! Charge stop! Okay. You know what? Maybe now we can... take a little bit of time to explore around here. Magnetic hammer! Break the crap out of this. I guess that's a good... Welcome visitors, says aliens. <laughs> Very nice. Uh-oh. You know what that sound is? It's time to get going. Already. Now these are just normal supplies. We can get these supplies anywhere. Even in the outer zone, the mid zone. We don't need to get these supplies here. Scrapper. I don't need it. Let's not stay too long then. If we see something like Olympian fragments, of course, then I want to keep it. Ah, the shield! Turn the shield off. Oh, I ended up going a different way entirely. Shoot, I just... I guess we'll just keep going this way then. Uh... How does that work out? Did we just keep following the road we're going? One way to find out, I guess. Some of these places... These tunnels here, we can't just go through it. It's amazing how conditions change. I thought we were done for before we came to this map, but then there's charge stops. Which helps with the battery, but... Yeah, I should figure out the fuel synthesizer too. Whoa, 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 whoa. As we have it, it's just sitting outside, not doing much. I guess we put it into a can, and then we can put the can into our car. That's probably how it works. That was a lot of radiation. I feel like we took a weird path today. I'm gonna chill off for a quick sec, okay? Please stop. Don't do that. It's the turncoat, right? I think it's the turncoat. I can't even! Oh my gosh, this is impossible. Okay, you know what? Forget about it then. This is impossible. It's just... Stop! Stop! Wait. Oh, I didn't have a part. Maybe that was the reason. I thought I had a part. I was freaking myself out. Left and right. I'm not doing great on health and all that either. Just want to be a little bit careful. Abductors. I, I would like the... Whoa. Wait. This is Park. You coming? Oh, it's coming. It's coming. Whoa, dude! What the hell? Basically attacked me by throwing that thing in my way. Crude panel. Now these aren't necessary, I guess. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. No! What is moving my car? Something is shifting my car... my handbrake. 
Goodness. Now my hood is all dead. I'll just go through. That's annoying. Oh my gosh, come on. Look, how can I collect any resources when things are like this? This is... Tense. This is intense, man. Let's use our blowtorch. Oh yeah, this lead plate of panel, I'm not even sure if we should be repairing it because it's fragile. Which means I guess it loses durability faster than everything else. It's something we gotta replace eventually. Please! This is making it impossible to do stuff like, you know, add ga Oh! It's cracked. Ceiling kit. I've got a ceiling kit. Yo, I, I don't have space. Put, put everything in here. Is this window really that necessary though? I mean, it's not like it really matters that much. Yeah, I see today is going to be a bit annoying with that turncoat. To the point that I feel like we need to just go. I would really like to fill my gas though, if you would let me. Okay, so now I take it from here. No, 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 no. I'm holding this. Okay, it's taking it off. It's not really letting me. Maybe I have to do it on the big can. I don't think we have much luxury for this though. <laughs> no, it just keeps... It's- oh god. I haven't figured out how to take it from the thing. You see what I'm saying? Like, I- I don't know why it's not letting me. Yeah, okay. I- I'll think about that later. I have the fuel. I don't know how to use it, but I have it. Hey, I feel like even- Does that actually give us more supplies? Just by using a different tool? Because it feels like it. I feel like we got more plasma than usual. Can you not be like that, please? Mr. Scary... Ghost? Okay, that's- that's a bit too much. We should go. <laughs> Let's go. Can I really not figure this out? It's just frustrating, but... Uh, right now... Gas is not my biggest problem. I think we'll be fine. How we looking? Not great. I think we have to pass multiple of these... These checkpoints. So let's just hurry up and do it. I didn't even collect any anchor energy today. It's pretty bad. Don't got that kind of time. Oh boy. Wait. Oh, I didn't even realize the storm has been coming in. Okay. I think my car should be okay. But every second we're in here right now is a second in the storm. Oh, those devil grinders are taking up the entire road. Trying to avoid it is probably hurting my car even more. Oh yeah. There aren't even supplies around here. Barely. It's only around the checkpoints. I'm just glad my battery isn't draining. I think out of all the things, Battery draining is the scariest thing for me. Even fuel. Fuel, we can we can get it from broken down cars and whatnot. But battery being dead, if you can't make a battery jumper, I think you're just you're just done. 
Actually, I do wonder what would happen in that case. Like, do they... I guess the storm will eventually kill you. Oh, there's a meteor. I don't have time to collect any of this. Ah, uh, there's some stuff here. I... Can we go this way? There's a lot going on here. Ah! I just want to get to the exit. We've somehow cut across to a different point. Can I just keep going forward? It's a broken one. Damn! Today... Well, we can get the story objective done, but I... Today's gonna be a pretty low resource collection day. I, I just haven't... I can't. I can't. Am I going backwards, by the way? Like, sometimes we usually see these before we enter the place. Just wanna make sure we're all good. Yeah, that one needs replacing, probably. But these better supplies do make it easier for us to survive. Just one blowtorch and we're good. Wait. Can I not heal that one? The one with the star on it? I think I got that from like a payload or something, I don't know. We good? We good. I, I can't heal this one. Can I... Was I here before? Oh no, I think it's... I thought it was already broken by me before. It scared me. I was like, what? Did I just somehow go backwards? Oh, but I don't think we can stay long because the, the storm is active right now. We need to get going. Very soon. I wish you would eat the stuff a little faster sometimes. Yeah, you know, we need to also get going soon because of that. Okay, the radiation's here. What the hell are you doing, man? Why- you're facing a completely different way! My bat- oh no, one of my tires is dead. Okay, this way, right? This way. How'd you turn around entirely? When I wasn't looking. Oh, that- It's right there! You good? You good? Chill! One sec. See, that was a regular, a regular explosives crate. Not that ticking, tumbling, whatever, the crap. I'm hoping we can just go straight. I don't think I'll have time to collect that tape, unfortunately. But... Why? We don't need any contacts on Oppie. We can ask her. We don't need a interview. Figuring out who she is. <laughs> Am I going the right way? Sort of. Yeah, okay. I think... Home stretch from here. My... One of my tires is not looking great. We'll figure it out near the exit. Actually, we're already- we're still within the radius of the storm right now. Maybe we should just leave this map. That might be a better idea. I mean, we sort of took a weird way today. Not really on the roads. Oh, I don't even have time to- I don't know why my battery was draining so much before. But I'm glad to see that's not a quirk then. Because the way it was draining just felt so damn fast. 
Okay. Now we just- we have to make it through. That's it. What was that one? Magnified explosions. All explosions do even more damage. Torn- okay, this is gonna be the dangerous one. This one we actually have to just leave. I don't want my car getting torn apart and whatnot. <laughs> It looks peaceful. They're like, hey, do you want to collect the tape? Do you want to collect the tape? I can't collect the tape if you put it in the middle of the woods. Why is it all of the anchors are in the middle of the woods? Are you kidding me? Whoa, whoa. I don't know what this means. I think this is part of the conditions here. We should go. We should go. Unless if we see a unique resource. We, we should go. Oh, this place is being so damn creepy and stuff, right? Oh, that's gonna blow up and... Is that an anomaly? I mean, uh, yeah, I guess so. Do you want to try scanning it? Blacksmith. Whoa! Yeah, okay. Mission accomplished. I... Uh, very unfortunately, none of the... energy is along the way to the exit. Very unfortunate. It's okay, that's not my biggest resource constraint right now. I honestly feel like we're at the point where it's okay. Like, we have... I feel like we can make it to the end with the equipment we have right now. It would be nice if we could get more stuff like Olympian Fragments, but I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna ask for too much, I just want to make it home safely and... As long as I'm in one piece, vaguely... That'll be good enough. But yeah, like, oh, all the energy is just so far away today, it's not viable. But, keep an eye out for stuff like the Olympian Fragment Veins. Maybe we'll see better in the dark. Yeah, that's just the normal houses and stuff. Oh, there's an abductor. Don't make me bang into things. Please stop. There are tourists everywhere! Even more than usual, I feel like. We need to go. Oh, this is so depressing. This is the scariest we've ever seen the deep zone. So far. So far. I'm just looking at that. Is that a resource? No, that's the blacksmith. That's the blacksmith! And abductors! And things! I'm sorry, I really must get going now. Thank you all for the hospitality. Well, we just sort of flew past that one. But now we're finally where we're supposed to be. Perpetual stability. Oh. We good? Well, we just have one thing here today. Okay, I need to fix- Ah, my wheels are all- Both of them are- Shoot, that's not good. Both of them are messed up. Give us the rundown, Francis. What? Me? The electrical grid is your department. Uh, you know the plan as well as I do. So you'd rather trust me than have to speak up for yourself? I- uh, uh... Guess you're on your own, driver. Good luck. Okay, fine. The regular anchors aren't enough to overcharge the Arc device to the level we need. 
but there's an old anomaly barricade we can piggyback onto. It's archaic technology, an early attempt to stop anomalies from drifting out into the wider Olympic Peninsula. It worked for some time. Until it didn't. But long enough to get the old wall built. The barricade's in bad shape, but what's a little rampant voltage leakage? Not like the ghosts and goblins of the Deep Zone will mind. And if they do, more the better for Francis. Huh? Appreciate the olive branch, Oppie, but boy, do you have a lot to learn about the paranormal. I'd be happy to give you a primer after all this is over. Ugh, hard pass. I'm far too old for that. The car will induce a current along the barricade, in the same way you did it crossing the old wall. Every connection point needs to be induced within a limited time. Electrify the entire barricade, and we'll have all the power we need. You heard him. Floor it, driver. Uh, so what you're saying is I need to drive, right? I think that's the one thing that we've been doing uh, well. Uh, debatable. But it's the one thing we've been doing most and hopefully it'll be... it'll be good enough. The zone is remarkably empty. There's not even any energy here. I collected a grand total of one core today. We'll just follow the road. Or we can kind of go up like this a little bit. Well, this place feels really barren though. I don't see any supplies today. Yeah, sorry. Sorry. Cutting through a tad. Maybe I shouldn't be, but yeah, sometimes you gotta live life on the edge a little bit. A little bit. You're near the barricade's operating station. Can you get in there and look around? We need something that'll give us the lay of the land. Like a map? I see there's no charge stop here today. Not gonna be that nice to me, huh? What was that? Sounded like somebody was laughing. Maniacally. Oh, thank you. I'll use that. We might want to um, finish up using this. Yeah, we do get more resources, don't we? Just for using a better tool. Which is crazy. You would have thought it's just collecting it better. But it collects more. That's insane, actually. And this goes faster. No, 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 no. This time when we go back, we're not gonna have collected much more resources than before. So maybe we still can't... Well, gonna be lots of upgrades we still can't make. Oh well. I haven't even... I've been barely been using this. Yeah. There you go, just in case. Is that not fixable? Doesn't seem like it is. Alright. I even made all the nice tools for today too, but none of them are really getting used. Whoa, this place is old. This is... 9V battery to electronics. There's a switch here. You want me to press the switch? Okay. Scan barricade map in the operations tower. Here. Anomaly barricade map. Perfect. I'm uploading the barricade map to your arc device. By my calculations, if you electrify all eight posts, you'll have all the power you need. Oppy, does that seem right? Does it seem right to you? I, I, I think so. Yeah, I, I ran the numbers a few times and I... Then get to it, driver. 
You're sounding so ominous, man. Uh, I need to figure this out. How do we... How do we use this? This takes... This takes battery to... Oh, maybe this is what was draining my battery before, huh? Maybe that's it. Do you just automatically use it? Do I need to put you into the car? That might be what was draining my battery earlier. I see. Not a quirk, but that. We just gotta drive like a mad person. Oh, this again. Okay. I don't have as much battery as last time, so I gotta be careful about the limb shield. Follow it. They don't want anything distracting me today. There's barely supplies, no anchors. We are at the second circle. Dun dun. Dun dun. Ah ah! Hitchhikers! Surprisingly, my battery's not going down. Even with a limb shield on. We are at the third circly circle. Oh, oh, oh! I don't know what that is. The blacksmith? Ignore him, ignore him. There is a cat opener. More like can't opener. Ha 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 ha! How come that circle. Okay, that circle. The green! Comes after a while. Looking good, driver. Turn on the headlights. <laughs> Immediately the battery starts draining. Oh, it's going a little bit. We'll be fine. As long as nothing crazy happens, which I can't guarantee, to be fair. You're making good time. Keep it up. We're halfway through. Be careful, don't touch any of those. Weirdos. Don't get out of the car to get some pneumatube. Whoa, whoa. We have a guest. A few more to go. Two more. I don't think we even need the. Oh, so cool, man. We've been driving for so long, now it's daytime again. Just wraps back around. It's like pulling an all-nighter. And what do you get at the end of an all-nighter? An A! An A on the test! An A on the paper! An A on whatever you were doing! That's a dang blacksmith. Let's go! Oh! Good thing I fixed my tires earlier. It's 
second last one. Give me encouragement, please, Oppie. Francis? Gotta let me know I'm doing the right thing. I think the green the green circle comes on a little bit too late. That's how I got confused last time too. That's the last one. Okay, okay. No, that's just me. The wipers was me. <laughs> Wait, why am I going past? Okay. We're not going to the exit. That's fine. Oh! We're going back all the way to the beginning. To the first one. It's a circle. For some reason, I, I just assumed we would be going to the exit. But there isn't even an exit today. Almost there. Oh, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Man, if we had... Th there's a time limit on this. We know this already. Gotta be careful. It's probably because I don't have the lights on, so I can't see what's in front of me. We're doing good. Limb shield putting in work. There it is. Well, that's why the green doesn't come on. The green only comes on if we reach the next barricade. Which we just did. Now what? Whoa, whoa. Drive through the electrified... Operation operating station. Rick charged. Arc device readings at 4.2 gigajoules and holding steady. Good. Then we're all set. The arc device is ready to go. It'll hold that charge for as long as we need it. The wheels messed up. Pedal to the metal driver. Storm's coming. Here? Oh, I don't think it's a good idea going down like this. But this is way closer. Hopefully- oh shh. Okay. Alright. Alright! Not smart. I think it'll still be faster than going around, though. Honestly. <gasps> okay. I'm worried about my wheel problem. Honestly, I feel like this is, um... <laughs> This is a little bit from like a content creation perspective too, but I, I think in these types of um, survival things, if you don't take risks, if you're too safe, maybe it's just a little bit too boring to watch, you know? I was like, I could be safe, I could drive on the road all day long, but when something horrible happens, that's when it gets good, isn't it? <laughs> but I didn't do that on purpose there. That was just, I just wanted to drive down there because I wanted to. Got 1.2 corrupted energy. That's it. Nice work out there. The whale could be a lot. Take your time and gear up. No telling what that remnant's going to unleash. The end of the road. It might be our last trip next. Wait, are you. Oh, this is too far front. Hold up. Hey, driver. I sent you something, if you don't mind taking a look. 
sure? Oh, in memoriam. That's good. In? In memoriam. Never forget. Ride together forever. Tobias is favorite cryptid of them all. If it's not too much to ask, uh, if you could put it on your dashboard, so Tobias can come along for the ride, for wherever you're going. Uh, but don't feel obligated by any means. No, no worries. It's been a while since I changed my stuff anyway. It's right there. Colossal floof. <laughs> high-tech go-kart steering wheel. I like my high-tech steering wheel. It's very... It, like, we, we were getting stuff done. Like, made me feel like I was doing good things. <laughs> Rally steering wheel. I'm gonna keep the wheel. I like it. Shock absorber shifter. The bee. Uh, I gotta try the dolphin. I haven't tried it since the beginning. Alright. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Let's... Let's gear up and let's check out the... The route first. The end of the road next time. Mm-hmm. I think this is going to be it. I, I don't think we'll even come close to getting all the upgrades, but I'll see what I can do. And when we come back, it'll be it.